All right, today we have a 2010 Range Rover. I'm gonna show you guys a little trick, something I use. Turn off that vacuum so you can hear me. As you can see right here, we've got a couple little uh, pieces of chocolate inside these holes. Uh, what I do is I got a little paper clip, works uh, amazingly well, is I'll just go in here and I'll kind of try to get that shadow so you guys can see what I'm doing here. I'll just take the, the little uh, paper clip, kind of poke it in the hole. Don't poke too deep because a lot of these seats have airbags in them. But basically what we do is just poke it in there and then I will use some interior cream. Hey, can you bring me that interior cream? And then I'll just poke this hole in here. This kind of breaks up the, uh, the chocolate that's in there. And then I'll take my interior cream and I'll spray that in there like that. Kind of massage it in a little bit. And then I will do it one more time. Just kind of careful not to poke too deep. You don't want to damage the foam underneath. But this is a really good technique, little trick that you can do. And then when you're all done and you massage in the cream with your towel, that's completely, completely gone. Little uh, detailing tip for you. Show you here. You can kind of see right here. See all this little. Try to zoom out a little bit, but you can see all these little specks of mayonnaise. It just kind of gets smeared in. So I'm going to show you what I do. I have just a standard paper clip that I've just folded, and I'm just going to wipe this and show you that. It, see, it won't come out because it's stuck down in the fibers. So what I do is I'll take my uh, interior cream that I use. I'll spray that in there. I will take my little metal paper clip. I'll kind of massage that in just a little bit. And I'll take my little metal paper clip and I will poke each individual hole until it's all clean to where I've poked all the holes. And what this does is this just kind of breaks up that uh, buildup from the mayonnaise. So by doing it this way, it really cleans everything up the way you need it to be so it looks really nice when it's all done and then just kind of massage it in there you may have to come back a little bit more we already did one over here on this seat had the same thing on that side so when it's all done it'll look really sharp now I'm gonna go back and just do a little bit more because I can still still see a couple more little specks but that's just a little tip that you can do to clean out the holes it works really really well so hopefully that helps you guys out and check us out at scottysmobiledetailing.com.